Huge tailbacks were seen in Calais as French officials simulated increased checks on their border. Worried that a Brexit would make already long traffic jams even worse, angry French customs officers said France is not ready for the customs changes that would be in place as Britain leaves the European Union on March 29th. The boss of the French customs union said officers will pay the price of Brexit as work hours could extend into the night with little supplementary pay. La douane c'est une une administration méconnue qui a déjà beaucoup souffert, on a perdu 6000 emplois. Et donc aujourd'hui, on nous demande d'affronter des chocs, la lutte anti-terrorisme, le Brexit, alors qu'on a démantelé notre réseau et on n'en est plus capable. Back on our side of the channel, Transport Secretary Chris Grayling was slated in January after testing a dry run of a lorry park on a disused airstrip. The exercise was branded a waste of time, with just 89 lorries taking part, equating to about 1% of Dover traffic. How's it been? All right, fine. No problems whatsoever. What do you think of this trial? Well, someone someone had to do it, didn't they, really? I'm, I'm not sure, really. I waste of time, personally. But at the end of the day, what will be, will be, eh? Just how severe tailbacks might be at the border can only be thoroughly assessed once MPs make their decision. Deal or no deal? With the Brexit deadline looming on the 29th of March, some hauliers are left wondering what will it take for them to keep on trucking.